good morning everyone today's lesson for grade 4 chapter 12 lesson 5 convert metric units page number is 801 I hope you guys are having your books in your hands and pencils uh, get ready for lessons boys okay uh, before starting today's lesson please uh, uh, take care of one thing I hope you guys finished the homework of uh, last lesson and I already uploaded the answers, correct answers in Pioneer and uh, Edmodo. You can correct your answers from there. Uh, secondly, please, boys, uh, don't send your homeworks through WhatsApp. Only submit it through Pioneer. If anyone till now don't have any access to Pioneer, he can submit it uh, through Edmodo till that time only. Okay. Let us start today's lesson, guys. Uh, the first thing convert metric units so we took three types of units uh, units of length units uh, for capacity the units for length units for capacity and units for mass you guys have to memorize this table I think I hope you already know about it uh, one centimeter that is equal to 10 millimeter so if we are converting from centimeter to millimeter, we'll times it by 10. We'll multiply by 10. 1 meter, that is equal to 100 centimeters. And 1 kilometer, that is equal to 1,000 meters. Similarly, for mass, uh, metric units of capacity. For capacity, uh, 1 liter, that is equal to 1,000 milliliters. And boys also write for mass 1 kilogram that is equal to 1000 grams okay so but the first question here they want us to convert 4 meters into centimeters so you will see from here we are converting from meters to centimeter. One meter is equal to 100 centimeters. If we want to convert four meters, we'll multiply four with 100. Four times 100, that is 400. Okay, here in example two, let me clear the screen so you guys can see clearly. Here, 5 liters, how many milliliters? We are converting from liters to milliliters, so we have to multiply by 1000 voice. In this lesson, we are using just the multiplication uh, operation, as they told you here. You can multiply to convert or change between units. Okay, so 5 times 1000. Why 1000? Because 1 liter is 1000 milliliters, so that is 5000. Okay. Let us move to the next page, page number 802 now. Okay, boys, here, as I told you, 1 kilogram is equal to 1,000 grams. So if you are converting from 1 kilogram, kilograms to grams, we multiply it by 1,000. 7 kilograms, 7 times 1,000, that is 7,000. Okay, boys, uh, let's move to the guided practice here. Uh, guys, this is the way you have to write these tables and on the next page uh, you have to solve by yourself. What they are writing here, look at this one, kilometers, if it is 1, the meter, that is 1000. Okay, They are writing it in parentheses in this way, kilometer, the first one is kilometer and the second one is meter, 1000. When the kilometer becomes 2, the meter is 2000. 3, 3,000, 4, 4,000. They are writing it in this way. Okay. Now here, these are the number pairs, boys. Uh, centimeters to millimeters. You guys know 1 centimeter, that is 10 millimeters. Centimeter, cm, you can see from the heading here. That is first 1 centimeter, second 1 millimeter. 220, 330, 440. I hope you guys understand the way how you have to write this one okay uh, the same thing here down meters to centimeters multiply by hundred 
and liter to milliliter multiply by thousand okay let us move to the next page uh, meters to centimeters multiply by hundred and kilograms to grams multiply by thousand okay uh, six liters how many milliliters multiply by thousand five meters how many centimeters multiply by hundred two kilograms how many grams multiply by one thousand five centimeter how many millimeters multiply by ten twelve kilograms multiply by uh, one thousand that is twelve okay boys here there's uh, one thing I have to tell you guys one meter that is equal to hundred centimeter and one centimeter that is equal to 10 millimeter okay so here they are asking us to convert from meters to millimeters if they ask us to convert from meters to centimeter we times by hundred and then from centimeters to millimeters we times it by 10 so first we have to times it by 100 then times it by 10 4 times 100 that is 400 centimeters now they want the answer in millimeters so we convert the centimeters into millimeters and 400 times 10 that is 4000 I hope you guys understand it uh, finish I let me clear the screen for you guys so you guys can finish your classwork uh, boys please try to solve it by yourself first and then check your answers uh, through this video next page Uh, 12 kilograms that is 12,000 grams 7 meters 700 centimeters 2 liters 2,000 milliliters the same thing here they are doing boys 6 kilometers into centimeters okay first you will convert it into um, meters 6 times 1,000 6,000 meters then one meter is equal to 100 centimeter then you will multiply it by 100 so 600,000 centimeters let me write it for you guys here this one also uh, one kilometer is equal to 1000 meter and one meter is equal to 100 centimeter so first you'll multiply by thousand six times thousand that is six thousand and then times by hundred so six hundred thousand i hope you guys understand the lesson uh, please try to finish your classwork and also your homework and send me your homeworks through pioneer only if you guys don't have access to pioneer you can submit it on edmodo also but please don't send me through WhatsApp. Have a nice day. Thank you so much.